Thank you for choosing LiftMaster. This video provides an overview of the steps for installing the IPDC access controller. This video is intended for demonstration purposes only. Please consult the manual for complete instructions and safety information. Typically, wiring and cabling has already been completed before installing the unit. This includes an Ethernet cable for connecting to the facility's network and a grounded AC receptacle. In order to power the IPDC, we recommend obtaining a LiftMaster PS12D2A power supply or equivalent before. If the network connection has power over Ethernet, then a separate power supply is not needed. Remove the IPDC from the box and make a note of the CP number located on the product label. Unscrew the housing and remove the mounting plate. Attach the mounting plate to the electrical box. Complete the internal wiring before connecting power to the IPDC. Identify the connections for the relay, the Wiegand accessories, and power. Remove the connector blocks for easier access when wiring. Insert wires into the connector blocks and secure by tightening the screws. Refer to the manual for complete wiring information. Insert the connector block for the relay that will control the maglock, door strike, or gate operator. Insert the connector block for the Wiegand card reader or LiftMaster passport receiver. Insert the Ethernet connector to establish the network connection. Before connecting power, make sure the P-cell jumper is positioned properly for your application. For our demonstration, we will confirm the jumper is not set for PoE. Finally, insert the power connector. Attach the housing to the mounting plate and secure with the screw. Complete the power wiring by connecting to the PS12D2A supply. The power outlet must be a dedicated 120 volt AC outlet located within 250 feet of the IPDC. This outlet should be on its own circuit with a minimum of a 10 amp circuit breaker. Hardware setup is complete. To configure the system, open a browser window on your computer, go to the liftmastercloud.com website and log in to your account. Click the facilities icon in the navigation menu. Select your facility. Click the controllers tab. Click the add new controller button. Enter the IPDC's CP number and type in a name. Click the save button. Complete the setup of the facility by adding doors, schedules, groups, and residents. For details about how to complete your community setup, consult the manual or watch our other support videos. Thank you for choosing LiftMaster. Learn more about our access control solutions when you visit us on the web at liftmaster.com access control.